Here's a simple survey that first asks for a person's gender and then the person's age. Then asks whether the person belongs to the League of Women Voters or the American Assembly for Men in Nursing. That's followed by questions of whether you drink alcoholic beverages or not and whether in the past year your consumption of alcohol has increased, decreased, or remained the same. The only problem with this survey is that if someone says they're male, we don't want to ask them if they belong to the League of Women Voters. If someone says they're only 18 years old, we don't want to ask about drinking alcoholic beverages. If the person is 22, we can ask, at least in the United States, whether they drink or not, but if they say no, we don't want to ask if their consumption of alcohol has changed because they don't drink. Here's how to set up a survey so that Lyme's survey will present a question only if the conditions for presenting that question are correct. Here's First, let's take the question of whether the person belongs to the League of Women Voters. To set a condition, you click this icon here. This question will always be shown unless we add or edit a condition. And the condition is that the answer to what is your gender has to equal female. And then we're going to add that condition. Let's go back to the survey. And now let's also go to the next question, whether the person belongs to the American Assembly for Men in Nursing, and add a condition to that question. And this question will be shown only if what is your gender equals male. Add that condition, and we can go back to the survey. First, when we come back and view the survey again, you'll notice that the two questions with conditions no, don't appear at all. If the person says that he is male, then the question, do you belong to the American Assembly for Men in Nursing, will appear. If the person is a female, then she will see the question, do you belong to the League of Women Voters? That having been done, we can now go back to the survey and put a condition on, do you drink alcoholic beverages? So we're going to set a condition for this question, and the condition will be that the how old are you question is greater than or equal to a constant of 21. Add that condition, go back to the survey, and let's test the survey. And this time, we see that if the person says that they are male and they are 18, the question doesn't appear. But if they say they're 22 years old, then do you drink alcoholic beverages does appear. This leaves us with just the one question, whether their consumption of alcohol has increased, decreased, or remained the same. Returning to the question of whether their consumption of alcohol has changed, we set a condition. And the condition that we're going to add for this question is if the answer to do you drink alcoholic beverages is equal to yes. That's the only condition under which we want to show that last question. And we can return to the survey administration. And now let's test the survey. If the person says she's female, It'll ask if she belongs to the League of Women Voters. If she says she's 18, that's the only question she'll get. If she says she's 21, then she will get the question of whether she drinks alcoholic beverages or not. If she says no, she won't see the other question. If she says yes, she will get the last question, namely whether the consumption of alcohol has changed or not. And that is how you add conditions to questions on Lyme survey.